Hi, it's your boy, Matty Ice. Um, today I'm going to make this quick, or I'm going to try to make this quick. Um, I don't know what time I have. It's 9.35. Okay, I got time. Um, I have to do a WebEx medium because of this stupid online crap. Let me tell you something. This coronavirus is so bad. It's so bad. I freaking hate it. Okay. I have to do, I am in college right now at Mississippi State. Y'all can tell, y'all can see that background. Y'all can see that, what school I go to. Anyway, not the point. The point is that 2020 sucks, okay? This year sucks, 2020 sucks. Everything about 2020, it sucks in general. You got the coronavirus that screwed everything up. I got, during the summer... When the coronavirus came in, too, it sucked. My best friend, or one of my friends, stabbed me in the back. Not my best friend. I meant to say friend. One of my friends stabbed me in the back. Got jealous. Made a big deal about things. And, but now everything's all good because we talked it out. Because we were like, bros come first. Anyway, let me tell you about girl problems. Girls. Yeah. I would say names, but this happened in the summer, so a lot of things happen. Um, I did have a first girlfriend, but like, but we're friends now, and everything's all good. But my other girlfriend... Yeah, well, that was a bad mistake. So, and not just that, in life, it kind of sucks. And so, which everything's all good now. I'm not sad about it. I put that behind me. Um, Let me check what time it is, sorry. I have to check the time because I don't want to be late to my WebEx meeting. Uh, 9.37, okay, I'm good. Um... So, I wish we could do Zoom instead of WebEx, uh, but we have to use WebEx because it's because we have to do online here at Mississippi State, so that kind of sucks, but it's also kind of good because I get to spend more time in my apartment, so I hardly don't have to go on campus that much and wear a mask. Um, I don't really like wearing masks all the time because knowing me, I get hot, sweaty very easily. I get hot sickness very easily, but... You know, and what people don't understand is some people can get paranoid about the coronavirus. Yes, is that a real thing? Do we need to worry about it? Yes. But do we need to get try to make a big deal, like an overreact really bigly? And suddenly at the point lose your mind and I, you're just being paranoid. Really, if you can just wash your hands about every morning and every night, Take good showers, make sure you're clean yourself, make sure your life is great and you don't worry about it. Just wear your mask, do what you're supposed to do. Don't cough on anybody or sneeze on anybody. Try to wear your mask when you need to wear your mask. Just um, if you have to take it off and breathe, take it off and breathe. Doesn't mean like, oh, I need to leave it on. And then suddenly freak out about it. And I'm like, if I take off my mask, I'm going to get coronavirus. Don't be like those people. Don't be like those people. I'm telling all of y'all, y'all of y'all are my fan, like, y'all are my followers. I'm looking out at my followers. And I'm telling you this, do not, if you need to take off your mask, take off your mask and breathe. If you don't, don't. But I'm just saying, don't do it around people that are like, and stay like, and if you're going to, like, do anything, stay away, like, six feet away. You really don't have to because, like, <laughs> you can do other things. You're not going to get it right away. That's for sure. You know, like, as long as it, you can keep yourself clean and do all that, you're fine. Now, can I say that this coronavirus sucks? Yeah, it does. I wish that it goes back to normal where I don't have to wear a mask. I can hang out with my friends. We can do cool stuff together. Everything is open up. But, well, guys, I don't think that's going to happen next year because next year it could happen again. Because 
But now they're saying what's worse right now, I think it's tied between the coronavirus or the flu. People have died from the flu. People don't realize it. And some of the younger kids, you know, of course, they're going to get feel better from it. There's some kids that probably have died. I don't know of. But like I said, there's trillions and billions of seeds out there. And you just have to learn how to take care better of yourself. And like people with littering and all that. Well, there's nothing you can do anything about it. You can't just stop a person from littering. The world is already kind of already trashed up as it is. You could try cleaning it up. You know, put it on those, like, trash boats. But you know where those all that trash goes? It goes, like, it kind of goes on that one island or it goes on that one place. And all it knows is when it gets filled up, then where else do you have to put it? That's what I'm saying is that if you're going to do something like that, they need to build a rocket and set it up, down, up in outer space or either that, grab all that trash and put it in a little, like, a big huge bowl and blow it up so all the trash will blow up in tiny little pieces and it's easy to burn but anyway and you know all this pollution and like we are always going to get under attack so like you know all this nuclear bombs and everything is kind of like making it worse now with Donald Trump he's a good president don't get me wrong Donald Trump is a great president I'm not Saying, like, y'all could have, I know that y'all have different agreements. Bear with me, because I am dyslexic, so if I miss anything, y'all can let me know in the comments. But what I'm saying is that Donald Trump is trying his best. You know, it's a job, okay? Everybody's going to hate Donald Trump. A lot of people are going to hate Donald Trump. I totally understand that. It's, I mean, but you got to realize he's doing his job. And he's trying, you know, he's trying to do his job, and that's what he's trying to do. So that's what he's trying to do is do his job, and that's the reason why. But for right now, he's doing, he's trying his best to make sure that the nuclear bombs or atomic bombs doesn't come off or set off. Now, he's trying his best. To figure out everything. I know that some of y'all are going to have a different disagreements. That's fine. Everybody has a different disagreements. That's understandable. I haven't done this video in a long time. I know I tend to keep saying that. But I'm telling you this. That I don't care. Look. The only thing y'all need to know. Is that. Donald Trump is trying his best. At his job. You know being the president. Is not an easy job. And everybody needs to know that. I know that I only got 40 subscribers, or I don't know if I got 41. I think I probably got more than that. I haven't been on YouTube in, like, forever. I know I've been making a lot of dubstep music, so I haven't been keeping up with the page. But for right now, everybody needs to cool it. Like, everybody needs to cool it, okay? Because, to be honest with you, like, you only live once. You only live once once you only live once and let me tell you and you have to have a motto never believe in false hope believe in good hope never believe in false hope never feel guilty about anything in life because if you do all it does is gives you bad conscience and make you feel bad if you feel about you always believe about good activity because if you don't well your source well this is a short world your age is going to die down a little bit and you could die at a young at a younger age you have to try to live your life to the fullest and make it big and i know this video is long and i want to say thank you for trying to watch this whole video if y'all can or stay bear with me. Anyway, this is this is all I got to say today. So give me a thumbs up on this video and hit the little bell. Subscribe to my channel if you're new or not. 
or I mean just whatever and I'll see y'all maybe when I have free time to make another video peace